Today there are still hundreds of thousands of refugees who cannot solve their problem without international assistance. Perhaps you are surprised. Perhaps you belong to those who thought that the refugee problem had been solved long ago. And you find it perhaps difficult to believe that even today there are still some 200 camps for refugees. And yet that's true. The world has not yet recovered from all the upheavals resulting from the Second World War. And whereas there were already hundreds of thousands of refugees from before that time with an unsolved problem, new refugees are crossing the borders now every day. And so it is that at this very moment, there are some 70,000 men, women and children in the so-called official camps. And in addition, some 25 or even more than 25,000 refugees in camps who are not called official. Statistics, however, are not a measure of the misery which the refugees suffer. And uh, their story, I think, must be considered to be one of uh, our present day's most difficult and most tragic problems. Now, of course, you can ask why don't they uh, emigrate to another country? The fact is that most of the refugees just cannot do that. They would like to, but there is some difficulty in the family, a member who is sick or too old, and that is why many in themselves excellent families have just been barred from emigration overseas because they didn't want to separate themselves from an old mother or from a sick child. And so they've had to stay in the camps and wait. And often you have the feeling that they just don't know exactly what they are waiting for. <laughs>